Why is the Earth, as small as it is, taking the size of the universe into the equation? The Earth could be hundreds of times bigger. Is it because God wanted to keep the population to 7 to 10 billion? Well, actually, no, although he's quite aware of how many people it could support. The Earth is the size it is within literally miles simply because of gravity. If the Earth were 10% smaller, life on Earth couldn't exist as we know it. If it was 10% bigger, the force of gravity would be so strong we would be nailed to the floor and couldn't move. And so it's exactly the right size that it should be with the law of gravity as God gave it. How can space go on forever? Logic tells me everything must, must have an end. I've always found this worrying. I, I, I can remember when I was an evolutionist and thinking about that. You know, uh, I think it's a common human thought uh, that the Earth must have an edge, therefore the universe must have an edge. Uh, and of course the question is, if the universe had an edge, what's beyond it? And the fact of the matter is that God created it. Uh, we don't know how big it is. We've never seen an edge. As far as we know, it does go on continuously. Now, there are some mind games that people play about the fact that gravity bends light and therefore it could actually turn into a loop long term, but I'd prefer not to play in mind games. The universe is as big as it is, whatever size it is, solely for the purpose of supporting life on Earth. You see, the universe has to be monstrously large for certain constants in nature to exist down to the nth degree, down to the hundredth digit, because otherwise life on Earth would be impossible. But nobody knows the answer to it having an edge, and if it had an edge, what's beyond it, we can't actually figure that one out. Maybe God will reveal it to us in time.